50 miles west of the Navajo Nation capital is a mother's plea. Please. I'm not asking. Joanne Migo is still searching for her son, last seen more than 10 years ago in Steamboat, Arizona. I am begging you guys to help me. If you see my son, let, let the winter up. Please, apartment, no. Derek Denorio grew up walking these trails near his home. Denorio was known to be quiet and shy. My brother was like, a, he was a really nice guy. He was always happy. He was serious. And every time I needed help from him, he would always um say yes. This is the area where he met the mother of his kids and was with her for up until he disappeared, went missing. But everything changed one night on August 5th, 2011. Denorio was walking through the familiar trails in the area known as Standing Rock. He was attacked by several um, guys that were partying up there. Later on, I found out that when he went to this party, they had given him a vodka bottle with um, a lot of painkillers. His mother says she talked to him that same night. I told him, you know, stay home. I'll be down there tomorrow morning. Don't go anywhere. And he said, OK. And that's the very last time I heard his voice over the phone. That's when life got turned upside down. Garrett was walking behind his brother Cedric and and all of a sudden, just like that, Cedric says that Derek just, just just took off into the woods and there was no moon or anything, it was pitch black. While Tenorio's family thinks he made his way back to his girlfriend's house, he wasn't seen ever again. It made me just feel like nothing, you know? There's nothing I could do and I was diagnosed with the what they call survivor's guilt because it's still on my mind every day, you know. Through the pain his mother, brother, and three kids endure together, they now walk through the area he was last seen. It's hard knowing that I'm walking the, the trail that he last walked. It hurts. His mother holding her son's missing poster as birds fly through the sky. Son, I want you to come home. We all miss you. If you can hear me, we need you home. Just come home, please. In Steamboat, Arizona, Stephanie Muniz, KYT Action 7 News. Derek Tenorio is one of almost 200 people on the FBI's missing indigenous peoples list. And we are always looking to feature families or groups connected to the crisis. Just email us at the address on your screen, koatdesk at hearst.com.